YouTube. This is a uh, junkyard Jeff with another video of an estate auction find. Uh, this bag of watches was in a beer flat with some other items, including a auric uh, iron used to iron clothes. Uh, I was bidding against an older lady that she bid up the flat uh, box of these items, ended up paying twenty two dollars and fifty cents. Um, she only wanted the iron, I imagine. Uh, I did sell the iron on eBay. Very nice condition, looked brand new, was not in the box. Uh, I sold it for $38 plus shipping. So these watches are basically free. And I went through them and like all estate items, you never know what you'll find. Uh, you come across a nice surprise. So I'll show you what was in this bag. This is how it came in a Ziploc bag with these watches. Most of these aren't anything special, but there is a pretty good one in here. Just a generic digital watch. Another Timex quartz that's not running another generic dead battery I think this is a fossil. Yeah, fossil. Maybe from the 2000s. It's not running. Another generic Celebrex. Not running. And there's some digital watches in here that are actually, they were working. Uh, here's a Timex Sport 1440. I did set the day and time and everything seems to be working. Pretty nice condition. And there's another digital that was working. Another Timex. Indiglo Expedition. The last two are the best. Um, this is, isn't the greatest of watches, but it's still for free. It's a Seiko Quartz. Uh, battery is dead. This was like a retirement piece. It's dated 25 years of service. Just 25 years. I'm guessing from the 90s, early 2000s. And then the best for last, this uh, this watch came on in its original band. I had, had to take it off. It, uh, its original bracelet, it was too small for me, so I just replaced it with this inexpensive uh, nylon strap that I had. It's a Seiko automatic chronograph. The serial number dates it from 1974 and the watch is running it's keeping time uh, unfortunately the chronograph functions aren't working uh, you press this top pusher and the second hand will go around about 58 seconds and stop and doesn't run anymore 
and the pushers do get stuck so I have to pop them out with some pliers. You have to press the bottom to reset it to the 12 o'clock position. Um, but the case is in pretty nice condition. I've worn it for about a week and it does keep excellent time within a minute or so every two days. So going to my personal collection. So very nice score for free.